good evening and welcome back to beerich markets are in real turmoil this day morning in the united states and late night in india when markets opened us markets opened positive at one point the markets were nearly 2% up i went to sleep and woke up today morning to find out the dow was down 2% and the nasdaq was down nearly 3% that's a massive swing during the day so these kind of turmoils are now pushing investors on their edge especially retail investors what should retail investors do and what should they not do at this point of time is a million dollar question for the last 2 years they have been an autopilot and anything they bought has gone up whether you bought bonds or whether you bought uh, stocks it just kept going up only now retail investors across the globe have realized that there is pressure and they cannot continue with business as usual most of these young kids have opened their accounts after the pandemic is over in fact in india several hundred lakhs of people have opened their dmat accounts after the pandemic period so they have never seen a bear market very few have survived the 2008 bear market this looks to be an extended bear market with more headwinds coming than tailwinds tailwinds are winds that push a plane forward and headwinds are winds that push a plane backward so headwinds meaning reasons that push the market down and tailwinds are reasons to for the market to go up at this point of time across the globe there are more headwinds than tailwinds so what are the few simple rules that you should do to protect your portfolio first and foremost stop trading when you trade it's your broker who makes money not you whether you win or whether you lose the broker collects his fee so he encourages you to trade and you end up paying fee over a period of long term your broking commissions that you have paid to your broker are a substantial portion of your earnings you made you will find that without broking fees you would have made a much larger sum of money so first learn to buy and hold a stock if you have bought a stock you should value it properly and buy it for a good reason unless the facts change you don't change your mind this is point 1 point 2 the core of a portfolio especially for a retail investor who does not understand stocks should be passive stocks passive investing means that you are investing money in a passive way and you really don't need the money if you are in a country which has high yield bonds it makes eminent sense to sell your stocks or portfolio and move to a bond which gives a higher return and slowly buy back your portfolio which you have sold at lower rates because it does not look like that the market is going to crater overnight this is going to be a slow long run out bear market so moving your fund to a bond with proper yield in countries like india gives you an option of holding your capital safe and getting monthly coupons either monthly quarterly or yearly as per your decision and you can keep plowing that money to buy back the stock that you have sold so this is a systematic way of buying what you have sold if the market craters by more than 25 to 30% from current levels that is the market reaches 40 45% from its previous high and which is what people are predicting for the S&P 500 it makes sense at that time to sell your bond and buy back the stock in that way you get to keep your cake and eat it too so you protect your capital the capital being your cake learn to understand dividend heroes throughout people who have followed me in my vernacular podcast in tamil notice that i would have given them several ideas to buy dividend stocks at very good rates if you had bought tata steel at 300 rupees or 250 rupees you are making a huge amount of money on dividends the dividend yield is in far excess of any d or bond rate you will make if you had bought tata steel at 250 if you had bought itc at 150 as i recommended you would have a high dividend yield strategy had you bought karnataka bank at 40 rupees 
that was a high dividend yield strategy so one must look at high dividend yield strategies add dividend heroes to your portfolio they will give you a steady passive income which you can invest in the stock market again if you don't need the money so my ideas are very simple don't trade if you have made a lot of money protect your gains sell your stock and move it to bonds and slowly buy back what you sold using the interest from bond coupons bond coupons are payable monthly quarterly and annually and with that you should be able to buy back your asset if the market craters by more than 40% from its all time high then you can consider selling your bond and investing portion of the money back in the market this helps you to protect your capital warren buffett famously said there are two rules rule number 1 is never lose capital rule number 2 don't forget rule number 1 at this point of time talking to people in the united states i feel that they have reached a point where most of them are losing money in stocks if you have a nest egg please sell it if you are nearing retirement protect your capital and re-enter the market at substantially lower levels if you do these following steps which i have discussed with you in great detail you will not only fireproof your portfolio you will make sure that you continue to invest peacefully so when you avoid paying huge fees in active funds pick passive funds add a low cost large cap fund and try looking to look for dividend stocks at the end of the day these following steps will make your personal finance look better while you plod along and make superior returns than who trades on a regular basis remember the hare and the tortoise story the tortoise wins in investment it's long term results that count thank you for watching be rich if you like the content kindly subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell notification if you do not turn on the bell notification you will be not notified every time we put out a video if you like the content kindly consider sharing with your friends and relatives once again i thank you for your support for be rich i have written two books in english the alchemy of money and ordinary stocks extraordinary profits these books are published by us and are ready if you want to procure a copy send us a message to the whatsapp number given below and my team would respond to you finally those who wish to consult with me can send a mail to beerichenglish@gmail.com once again i thank you for your support If you like this video press the subscribe button of my channel hit the like button and turn on the bell notification